Welcome to my video on how to apply lip scents. Okay. Most important when you're um, using lip scents is to give it a good shake. Okay, you'll hear that there's a ball bearing in there. Shake it up and down like this. Do not tap it like this because a ball bearing will then hit the side um, and it can break the, um, the tube. So best to, to shake it up and down. Okay, give it a good shake for, you know, a good 30, 20, no, yeah, 30 seconds or so. So the other thing you need to do is make sure you have clean, dry lips, okay? So wipe off any foundation that you may have on your lips. Or if you've been wearing lip balm or lip volumizer, we'll wipe that all off. You can just use a towel. If you prefer, you can do... Um, I don't have it on me at the moment. You can do um, witch hazel and you know and a, and a wipe. Okay. I just like to make sure it's all done. Okay. Do I make them all nice and dry? That will help to ensure that your um, lip sense of, um, adheres the best. Okay. So shake up your product. Okay. Open it. You'll hear a crack when it's the first time that you've opened it. <laughs> okay, when you take it out, okay, scrape off the wand, okay, and you will see that the wand is tapered. So, see that? It's tapered. Now, there's two different ways that people um, apply their lip scents. The first way is by outlining, and that's how I do it. I will do an outline on one side and non outline on the other side. So, if I'm going to outline, Excuse me, I've got a little mirror down here. Okay. I use the tip, just the tip tip up there. Okay, and I go and I draw the line. Okay. And same for the bottom. I'll draw the line where I want it to be. Okay, and then what I do is I come back, I tap, I do it once more, a bit of a scrape. You don't want too much product on there. Um, they're meant to be three thin layers. Okay, and then because I already know where I'm starting and I've got the the area, I fill it in. So one direction, remember? One direction. Okay, if you've got Nice full lips, you may need to go down there like that, and up the top, you might have to go out and then in the inside a bit more. If you've got slightly fuller lips than I do, okay, keep your lips apart. Now, if you don't, if you're not one that wants to outline it, so you would take it, you would scrape off the majority of the color, okay, and then you can apply. So, you can either apply, so going up and down or from the corner. And up. One direction. Okay, and then corner and down. Okay. Either way works. There's no right or wrong. One thing you do need to do, keep your lips apart. Okay, make sure the first layer is where you want it to be. Okay. So I like the sharpness of it, so I'm actually going to go and outline that side. Okay, so I'm just going to grab it, I wipe off the excess, turn it to the tip, and I'm just going to outline. Make sure they're even. Sorry, <laughs> I realize I'm covering it up. Make sure they're even, okay. Now, a good thing about doing this is that A, lip sense doesn't bleed. So you don't need a liner. One product, if you like to outline your lips, can do that. If you want to outline your lips in a darker colour, you can certainly do that as well. Okay? So now it's for the second coat. Okay? So, and, and 
inside. Let's tap once, scrape it off. Second coat, let that dry. Even though it doesn't take very long to it to dry. And that's why you don't want it too thicker layers, because if you put, if you just go and, and put a thicker layer on it, it takes longer for it to dry. Um, and it's also, the, it's also can crack as well, depending if you like make it really, really, really thick. Okay. Okay, so third and final coat. And as you can see, it doesn't matter if you start that oat or that oat, it doesn't matter. A little bit. All right. And you can start in the middle and go out that way. At the top. And then at the right here. As long as, long as you don't go back and forth and back and forth, it doesn't matter. Okay, so that's my three, my three layers. I'm going to wait for that to dry. It doesn't take very long. Keep your lips apart. Don't put your lips like don't put your lips together. Okay, and try and keep them taut if you can as well. It just helps. Okay, you'll know when it's dry. You'll be able to feel it. I like to kiss off on my hand, and if, if the waterline is a little bit wet, it'll show up there. This is fine. So then you chop it with a gloss. I'm putting glossy on for today, just so I can show you what it's like. This is our most hydrating gloss that we have. It's full of shea butter and vitamin E. Okay, so that wand is completely and utterly white. You can see I'm definitely going over that color. Okay, and that. You saw it, that's why. And I've just gone over this colour. Pretty awesome, isn't it? Yeah. If you're not a glossy gloss person, and this will this will sink in. Okay, so in yeah. 15, 20 minutes, that'll become more of a matte. But if you're not a really, really glossy kind of person, then we have like 15 different glosses. So we've got pearl gloss, matte gloss, Colored glosses, you know, I'm just picking some out. So we have a matte gloss that you can pop on. It's like a velvety finish. It's quite a nice finish. We've got colored glosses, and this looks this looks like it's going to be um, fluoro orange, but it's actually quite a quite a nice um, coral tone. See that? Especially if you're on the warmer tones or you like your corals, that's actually a beautiful colour. My daughter um, was wearing it on a market over the weekend and it was really, really nice. And then we've got ones like this. This is our pearl gloss. What I'll do is I'll just show you a little bit of the pearl. I'm just mixing it up in the tube because it's been there. Okay, I'm just going to put a little bit just on, on here. You can see the difference. Can you see that? So it... You'll see that it just gives it a bit of a pearly kind of feel. Done. I'm done for the day. I'll grab a gloss, pop it in my bag, and just before I eat, I'll chuck it on just to help protect it. But honestly, it's guaranteed to last between four to eighteen hours, and usually I can get longer. Have a great time. See you soon. Bye.